moving on, we'll begin with the seed tech lectures. Seed drying and processing. Seed drying involves uh, removing excess moisture from the seed. It is important because seeds with higher moisture content can have reduced viability and more susceptible to fungal and bacterial infection. The first step in seed drying is to remove any debris such as leaf or dirt right, from the seed so that it can be uh, good for testing and it has more market acceptability. Next, the seed are spread out within the thin layer and allowed in air, dry and well ventilated area so that its moisture is gone. For the larger seed, we have dehumidifier, right? And after the seeds are dry, they are processed to remove any remaining debris or foreign material. This is can be done manually by hand picking the seed using machine, cleaner or separator. Now seed testing for quality assessment. Seed testing is an important step in determining the quality of seed. It involves evaluating the seed for germination rate, impurity, vigor, and other characteristics. The germination rate is determined by planting the sample of seed and absorbing the percentage of seed that was successfully germinated. And what is purity testing? It involves determining the percentage of sample that is actually desired by the species and not contaminated with other debris. You know why vigor testing is important? Vigor testing involves evaluating the ability of the seed to germinate and grow under less ideal conditions, such as high or low temperatures. Other seed characters include seed size, weight, etc. Right? What is the why seed treatment is important? How we discuss? And what is seed treatment? Seed treatment involves applying chemicals or the substance to seed to protect it from the pest or diseases and other threats. Seed treatment is important because it can increase the yield and quality of the crop reduce the risk of disease and pest outbreaks and improve the overall health of the plant. Seed treatment can be applied using a variety of methods including seed coating, seed pelleting, seed soaking and seed spraying. Now moving on to the next slide uh, about the seed storage. Seed storage is very important for this aspect for the seed longevity and quality of the seed. The general principle of seed storage includes keeping the seed dry, cool, and free from pests and other contaminants. Seed storage can be divided into three stages. One is short term storage to one year, medium term storage to five years, long term storage more than five years. Factors then can affect seed longevity during storage include temperature, moisture content, oxygen level, and exposure to light and pests. Now, uh, going on, we take the particular example of uh, rice. Seed treatment is crucial for rice cultivation that involves applying pesticide, fungicide, biological agent before planting. The goal of seed treatment is to protect the seed and the emerging seedling from the pest and disease and promote healthy growth and growth. Here are some examples of seed treatment that are commonly used in rice cultivation. One is the chemical seed treatment in which we are applying imidacloprid, thymaxone, and metalaxone to prevent it from the seed from the pest and diseases and we have a healthy seed and greater market acceptability. Now biological seed treatment we are using uh, good biological, uh, we, we, we will not call pathogens, good biological you can say microorganisms like trichoderma, pseudomonas fluorescence and bacillus. Right? And I want to tell you uh, one thing that these biological agents were taken to Hanover Messi Fair uh, when Mudiji went to Germany 4-5 years back. Right? And the sample was taken from GB Pan University of Health and Technology, Pallar, which is nearby to Tirthankar University. Right? So, nutrient seed treatment involves the application of nutrients to the seed. These nutrients can help promote healthy growth and development and enhance crop yields, like NPK, nitrogen, uh, phosphorus, pollution. We are separately applying them, other than the fertilizers. Right? Now, few points we have to remember uh, for the seed, uh, good seed life is we have to dry the moisture of the seed to 12% to prevent mold and pest infestation. Clean the seed to remove debris, chaff and broken grains. Treat the seed with fungicide or insecticide and store in the plastic or metal containers. Break. In the dry place away from the sunlight we have to store, we have to maintain temperature 10 to 15 degrees Celsius, relative humidity of 50 to 60%. Right? 
So these were the important except of the seed storage.